Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the kitchen. Today, we're gonna to make our coconut chocolate chip cookie bar. Please click like and subscribe so we can bring you more recipes. Okay, so we have all of our ingredients here. Our mise en place is ready. And what I'm gonna do is I have our melted butter. Here's our three ounces of light brown sugar, and I'm gonna stir it together first. I find it best to dissolve the brown sugar into the melted butter first, and then add it into the graham cracker crumbs. You wanna dissolve all of the brown sugar in the butter. Make sure there's no lumps, get it completely dissolved and then you can drizzle it in and fold it into the graham cracker crumbs. Now, I have our lasagna size pan, our nine by 13 inch baking pan ready. It has two pieces of parchment paper that are folded, so that way when we wanna pull it out, we just pull the parchment paper up and it's already on a baking tray. So let's get this mixed together. So I've mixed the butter and sugar together and make sure it's completely mixed in and then you're gonna just drizzle that into our graham cracker crumbs and stir that together and then we'll put it into the bottom of our baking dish. Here's our crust. So now we're gonna get this in here and we're gonna spread it around and this is obviously a lot more than the first time we did it. And another thing is, is that we're gonna put it in a 300 degree oven for about seven minutes, six to seven minutes, so that way it can sort of cook together as well before we add all of the other ingredients on top. And that's what I do with my cheesecake crusts. And you can press, use the back of a spoon to press it down firmly or an offset spatula. So I'm gonna get the crust prepared. The crust was in the oven at 300 for six minutes and I've turned the oven up to 325 and now we're going to do our layers. So we have our coconut, we're going to get one layer of coconut first, then we're going to add the walnuts. We have our coconut and the walnuts and now we're going to sprinkle on our marshmallows all over. Next our chocolate chips, five ounces of chocolate chips and now our condensed milk. And I can see right off the bat, the condensed milk, you're just gonna drizzle it all over, is so much thicker than the cream of coconut. So this probably will make all the difference in the world and will be the reason why this sets up. So I drizzled the condensed milk over the top. I'm gonna let this sit for 10 minutes so that can sort of spread around. And then I'll put it into our 325 degree oven for 25 to 30 minutes. Doesn't that look wonderful? Look at all those marshmallows, little golden brown. So this was in the 300 degree, 325 degree oven for 30 minutes. We gotta let it cool so we can unmold it and then cut this into nice bar shapes. Here are our beautiful dream bars out of the oven. Look at that golden brown color. I can't wait to try this. These are so rich. I'm gonna cut these into one and a half inch rectangles. So they're bite sized and delicious. Please leave me a comment below and let me know how you like it. Thank you so much for watching. For more recipe demonstrations, please click like and subscribe to Chef Victoria Loves YouTube channel and have fun in the kitchen. Thank you.